Welcome to another Tableau tutorial video. I'm Weston Palmer. If you find these videos helpful, consider supporting me through Patreon. I've been wanting to do this for a couple weeks, and so I'm excited to get in on this. Uh, bear with me, it's a little bit involved, and I'm gonna show you a lot of things that went wrong. So this is using the Superstore data, and we've got the subcategories along the side here, and we've got average annual value. And we wanted to see what is the total or what percent is of this average annual value is for accessories and art and furnishings and such. And you can already see that there's a problem, right? 123%, 150%, 243%. So what's going on? You've probably come to here. You're going to click on compute using. You're going to try every option. You're going to go to edit table calculation and it's not going to work. I'm going to show you what the problem is. First of all, though, let's take a look at the data that I've had to manipulate a little bit. Every time it comes down to data structure, well, most of the time. Even though this is the Superstore data, you'll notice that I've got, I've already created another subtable, accessories, or subcategory, year, and then the value. And the reason you do that is because if you're looking at all the different transactions, this is not going to work. The first step was coming here and putting subcategories along the left hand side and then years across the top. Looks good. And now I want to have an analysis. I want to add totals here. That looks good. Well, that is the, oh, the reason that looks good is because I had already come in here earlier and said total using average. The default, if you have a sum, is going to be sum and so you need to come here and change that to average right and so once I got that you'll notice that that's that average is the average that I wanted great so I come back here get rid of the year and we're going to change this to it's already changed to average you can change this to average, and the numbers are the same. You'll have to trust me on that. I'm going to go a little bit fast. Copiers, copiers. Okay, so they're the same. So then I come in here and do just what we've done before, and I'm going to change this to percent of total. And we get those 100% and stuff. So let me go back a couple steps. I'm going to show you what I did. This is something that I often do just to make sure that I'm calculating it correctly. I copied this information into Excel. And so you're gonna see these values here. These are what was in Excel. I mean, these are in Excel, that's what was in Tableau. This is a sum function, just adding it up for the years. And then this average is the average across, right? And so the value that I want to have is this 41,000 divided by the 574,000, right? So what's happening? Well, what I did was I started backing into this number here. I said, okay, 41 divided by 123, what does that give me? 50,000 divided by 150, what does that give me? And what I found out, what is happening, what Tableau is doing is, it's taking the average of all these values right, the average of the total, and the average is 33,000. So when you come back to Tableau, 33,000, 41,000 is 123% of the 33,000. So it's giving you this value as a percent of the total by year values of the average, if that makes sense. So the denominator is the average of all of these values. And it's saying, okay, what percent is, is this of that? And that's why you're getting those weird 100%, over 100% numbers. Okay, great. So now what do we want to do? So I'm going to, I created a calculated field. We did this earlier. And the first thing I said was, I want to create, I want the average value. I want that 41,000, right? That matches here. But now I want to divide it by the window sum. 
right? And that this window sum, this average value here is going to give us the total of this. It's summing up the average value, all right? So put it here. And now we get those percentages that are more in line with what we were expecting. So that's how you do it. And look at it again. We're taking the average value. And the key here is whatever field you have that's calculating here, in here it's average value, that's what you want there. And you're dividing it by the window sum. This is adding up all of these, whatever this calculation is here. So if you had uh, something else in here, that you'd still want that. So this is adding all those values up. Hope that helps. Uh, I know that kind of racked my brain for a while. Leave, my, leave some comments. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching. I hope you'll subscribe and turn on notifications so you know when new videos are released. Check out some of these other videos I think you'll find helpful.